Hello Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on your love life. If you are new to my channel, welcome. So let's find out what is going on in your love life. Let's focus on the energy of the individual that you are dealing with. Past and present energies. Wow, okay. So what I'm seeing in this situation is that this person felt a very distinctive connection to you in the past, okay? This particular card here is giving me an impression that this individual had a lot of feelings for you on the inside, but I feel as if they couldn't express those feelings. There's an energy of this individual perhaps, you know, daydreaming a lot about you, but not being able to take action about those, you know, daydreams that they had for you. So I feel like they fancied you a lot. They kept a lot of it on the inside. They didn't allow it to come to the forefront. Maybe the circumstances weren't allowing for it. You know, even if you're dating a person or, you know, you're getting to know a person, whatever stage you are in your relationship, this feels like an energy of not being able to express those deeper feelings. Maybe they were afraid. Maybe they didn't know what you would think. Maybe they were, you know, scared, you know, whatever it could be. Now, this card is in reverse position. This is a card of knowing deep in their heart that they would like to build something with you, right? Knowing deep in their heart that um, they have these feelings for you but not being able to work things out. Now, it feels like the type of energy where things were just getting in the way of this relationship concern and this person didn't see a way around it. I feel like there is a helplessness here connected to this uh, type of energy because I feel like this individual you're dealing with, they're the type of person that would like to, you know, work hard at things. It feels as if there's an energy here where they really like to put their heart into things, but under these circumstances, whatever the two of you went through, it feels as if they felt as if, uh, you know, there's obstacles here. They don't know how to work these things out. They don't know how to resolve some of these problems. So I do pick up a sense of helplessness here, right? And I'm also picking up another energy. It's very subtle. But there was a desire here on the part of this individual to, uh, you know, have everything be as perfect as possible for the two of you. But uh, they didn't uh, have the ability to make that into a reality, unfortunately, right? Now, the next card is showing to me that this individual, you know, they had so much emotion and energy inside of you, but they just couldn't follow it. They couldn't do what they needed to do in the situation, right? And that could have you know, pushed you over the edge in certain instances, it could have made you feel like perhaps they don't care. Well, they did care and they still care, right? But there's this energy of not being able to follow their heart, not being able to do what needed to be done when it had to be done for you. It feels as if something was either 
presenting itself in your relationship with this individual that might have been getting in the way. It might have deterred this individual or it could have been a distraction. It could have been something that was not really allowing for the two of you to come together. And you'll know what these factors are. But this person didn't like the fact that their heart belonged with you, yet they couldn't bring the two of you together, right? Now, there's a lot of emotions here. There's a lot of emotions that this individual experienced. At times, it felt as if it was pulling them apart. It felt as if it was pulling them in two different directions. And the difficult thing here was that this individual had no control. They had no power. And I am picking this up from, you know, these three particular cards. There's an element of powerlessness here that is coming across very strong from the energy of the individual that you are dealing with. So that's telling me that the two of you might have had the stacks against, you know, uh, this relationship. It might have felt like even though both you and this person had these intense, intense feelings for each other, there's things getting in the way here, and this was tearing this individual apart. It feels as if, you know, their mind and heart was two different things. It feels as if their body and their soul were two different things because in spirit they were with you, but, uh, you know, maybe physically they were not. So this is, uh, you know, it led up to a lot of heartbreak. There's definitely a lot of heartbreak, a lot of pain if you're a feminine, you know, if you are a feminine, you may have been wanting to drag this person by their hair and pull them around like this, right? So I feel like it might have driven the two of you literally up the wall. Now, what I'm also seeing is two major arcana cards, which is indicating this situation was a major sort of thing for this person concerned. And it's one card is in reverse, one card is in upright here. Both is linked in with the number three, which is, you know, very significant in the situation. There's no coincidence for these energies being present in the way that they are. Let's look and see what's presently going on. I literally have the, you know, impression from these particular cards, the situation um, toward the heart out of this person's uh, body. That's what it did to them. Present energies. For those of you that are interested in learning how to read tarot, you can check out the courses and books in the description box below. There is going to be an extended reading where I'll be looking at these energies in greater detail. Okay, so this card is in reverse position. What's interesting about this particular card, it feels as if the energies have been very distorted during this uh, situation. You know, the past had an effect upon the present. There's a lot of conflict here. There's a lot of energies that are centered around not being able to be vulnerable or afraid of humiliation, afraid of something in this situation or circumstances. Could be hard for the two of you to talk to one another. You know, I feel like things got really messed up in the past. And so it's hard for the two of you to come together. And it feels as if both you and this individual are on a certain sort of position on the wheel, you know. And there's a hope for things to turn around. But the way things stand, it feels as if the conflict, the tension that rose up in the past caused a lot of animosity in the present. It caused a lot of humiliating type of energies. You may have said certain things to this person. It's not, um, you know, um, difficult for a Sagittarius to be as blunt as possible. And that's a strength and something that can be um, very painful for the person that is on the receiving end of it, right? So I feel like there's a lot of hurt emotions here, but there's a hesitation to really face this difficult, difficult type of feelings. Yeah. 
Yeah. I feel like someone has walked away and the possibility of reaching out to each other right now is very difficult. Yeah, it feels like there's still a chance here, but it feels as if one person has either walked away, it could be you, it could be this individual, and coming back together is very difficult at this point in time. So I feel like things are still, you know, on shaky grounds for both you and this individual concerned. This situation definitely causes a lot of pain, not just for you, but also for this individual. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these energies on an extended reading. I'm going to be looking at how is this individual really perceiving the situation? What are they feeling, thinking? How should you move forward in this situation? Because it feels as if there's a window of opportunity here, but you know you might have to really think hard and long about how to take that opportunity because it feels as if one energy is moving away. And if you want to you know, try to salvage this because it feels as if there's a lot of jaded emotions, then perhaps having a proper plan of action is going to help. I'll be looking at their mind, heart and soul on a deeper level and seeing what's really going on inside of this person's energy and what is the right way to approach things given how broken it was in the past and how uh, you know challenging it is in the present. I hope you guys have enjoyed your reading. Have a wonderful day and take care Sagittarius.